here let us find if x plus 1 is a factor of the following polynomials. So the first of them is x cube plus x squared plus x plus 1. So before we go on to this, let us now find the 0 of x plus 1, which is nothing but x plus 1 equals 0, and therefore x equals 0 minus 1, which is minus 1. Therefore, the 0 of x plus 1 is minus 1. So, now, if x plus 1 is a factor of, let us consider this to be p of x. If x plus 1 is a factor of p of x equals x cube plus x square plus x plus 1, then p of minus 1, that is p of the 0 of x plus 1 should be equal to 0. So let us see if it is equal to 0. So p of minus 1 equals minus 1 whole cube plus minus 1 the whole square plus minus 1 plus 1. So we have minus 1 the whole cube is minus 1 plus minus 1 the whole square is plus 1 plus into minus is minus therefore this is minus 1 and plus 1. So the negative positive negative positive gets cancelled and hence we get 0. So therefore p of minus 1 equals 0 which says that x plus 1 is a factor of x cube plus x square plus x plus 1. Let us go to the next polynomial now which is x to the power 4 plus x cube plus x square plus x plus 1. So again if x plus 1 should be a factor of this expression then p of minus 1 considering that this is p of x p of minus 1 should be equal to 0. So let us check that so p of minus 1 will be equal to minus 1 to the power 4 minus minus 1 the whole cube plus minus 1 square plus minus 1 plus 1. Minus 1 to the whole power 4 is plus 1. Minus minus 1 cube is minus 1. Plus minus 1 whole square is plus 1. Minus 1 into plus 1 equals minus 1 plus 1. We have here 1 minus into minus is plus 1 plus 1 minus 1 plus 1. So 1 minus 1 and 1 plus 1 gets cancelled and the remaining is 3 which is not equal to 0. So therefore x plus 1 is not a factor of x to the power 4 minus x cubed plus x squared plus x plus 1. Let us see if x plus 1 is a factor of another polynomial. That polynomial is nothing but x to the power 4 plus 3x cubed plus 3x squared plus 1. So again, if x plus 1 should be a factor of this expression, we should have p of minus 1 to be equal to 0. Yes, considering this as p of x. Therefore, we have minus 1 to the whole power 4 plus 3 into minus 1 the whole cube plus 3 into minus 1 the whole square plus 1. Minus 1 to the whole power 4 is 1 plus 3 into minus 1 whole cube is minus 1 plus 3 into minus 1 the whole square is plus 1. So therefore, 1 into 3 is 3 plus 1. So we have 1, 3 into minus 1 is minus 3 plus 3 plus 1. Here minus 3 and plus 3 gets cancelled and left out is 1 plus 1 which is equal to 2. So 2 is not equal to 0. Therefore, x plus 1 is not a factor of x to the power 4 plus 3x cubed plus 3x squared 
plus 1.